Hey, what's going on everyone? In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can turn AirDrop on on your iPhone and this will allow you to send videos, photos and music between your iPhone and other iDevices such as iPhones, iPads and also Apple computers as well. So the first thing we need to do is go ahead and open up the settings app on our iPhone or iPad. Now once we're in here, we just want to scroll down to general now once we're in here we just want to go to the airdrop section and in here we want to make sure that this selection is set to everyone and this will allow us to send files to pretty much anyone in close proximity to our device or alternatively if you only want to send material between yourself and your contacts then you can also put that on contacts only or you can set it to receiving off if you don't want to receive any uh, kind of videos or photos. So in this video, I'm going to set it to everyone as I want all the people to show up in my close vicinity so I can send them files. Now, once I've gone ahead and turned that on, I then want to ensure that I have my Bluetooth is on. So I can simply do this by sliding up from the bottom of my screen and then I can just go ahead and make sure that the Bluetooth is on blue or alternatively, if I'm on the iPhone 10 and above, I can and simply slide down from the top right hand corner of the screen as well. So now that I have AirDrop turned on on my iPhone, the next thing I want to do is go ahead and send a photo to my laptop. So I can easily do this just by going to my Photos app and then I can go ahead and select one or more photos. So in this instance I just want to select uh, maybe just three photos. Now once I've selected those I just want to go to the Export uh, tab just down the bottom left hand corner of the screen. Now, once I'm in there, I do have the airdrop tab here, so I can just go ahead and tap that. And now this will bring up all the people in close proximity to my iPhone that I can now send uh, kind of photos and videos to. So now I'm just going to go ahead and tap this. And as you can see on my laptop, I now have the ability to go ahead and either decline or go ahead and accept these photos. So now I can go ahead and save the photos to the downloads. And now the transfer is complete. And now I've gone ahead and sent those photos. So there you have it guys. That's a really quick and simple way on how to turn on AirDrop on your iPhone device and also how to send photos between iDevices as well. So hopefully this quick video on how to airdrop on your iPhone has been helpful. If you'd like to see any other videos like this, please let me know down in the comment section as I'm really happy to make more videos for all of you out there. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.